Morning, October 6th. Whosoever drinketh of the water that I shall give him shall never thirst. John 4, 14. He who is a believer in Jesus finds enough in his Lord to satisfy him now, and to content him forevermore. The believer is not the man whose days are weary for want of comfort, and whose nights are long from absence of heart-cheering thought, for he finds in religion such a spring of joy, such a fountain of consolation, that he is content and happy. Put him in a dungeon and he will find good company, place him in a barren wilderness, he will eat the bread of heaven, drive him away from friendship he will meet the friend that sticketh closer than a brother. Blast all his gourds, and he will find shadow beneath the rock of ages, sap the foundation of his earthly hopes, but his heart will still be fixed, trusting in the Lord. The heart is as insatiable as the grave till Jesus enters it, and then it is a cup full to overflowing. There is such a fullness in Christ that he alone is the believer's all. The true saint is so completely satisfied with the all-sufficiency of Jesus that he thirsts no more, except it be for deeper draughts of the living fountain. In that sweet manner, believer, shalt thou thirst, it shall not be a thirst of pain, but of loving desire thou wilt find it a sweet thing to be panting after a fuller enjoyment of Jesus' love. One in days of yore said, I have been sinking my bucket down into the well full often, but now my thirst after Jesus has become so insatiable, that I long to put the well itself to my lips, and drink right on. Is this the feeling of thine heart now, believer? Dost thou feel that all thy desires are satisfied in Jesus, and that thou hast no want now, but to know more of him, and to have closer fellowship with him? Then come continually to the fountain, and take of the water of life freely. Jesus will never think you take too much, but will ever welcome you, saying, Drink, yea, drink abundantly, O beloved.